is it that you feel? Do you feel the darkness? Or do you feel the light? I feel nothing because I was born in the darkness. I was molded by the darkness. <laughs> Mr. Wayne. Alright, that was lame as shit. <clears throat> yeah, cut that out, editors. Cut that out. Oh, wait, I don't have editors because I'm broke as hell and I have to do it myself? Nice. <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> Guess my phobia by the cut. Do you know what I mean? If you don't know what a phobia is, it's a fear. What are you afraid of? Do you feel the darkness? All right, no, we're just going to hop in straight in this video before I get more cringy. Okay? No matter what, don't freak out. All right? Just go ahead. Yo, hey. it's okay. You guys are going to see where you can walk. Arachnophobia. Okay, hold on. I'll connect. I'll connect. I'll connect. Must have had to run in with Spider Man in the past. <laughs> uh, my name is Parker. I'm Crystal. Sid is my name. What are you afraid of? What am I afraid of? Yeah. I'm pretty scared of heights. Do you have any phobias? <laughs> uh, do I have any phobias? Uh, not that I'm aware of now. You're going to be guessing what people's phobias are. Oh, do I have to experience it? What if I have one of the phobias? Yeah. Well, everybody, I don't know that Do we get it like a list? No, no. So we're going to give you a phobia. Ooh. They look fearless. Hi. Hi. Ah! <laughs> okay, everybody in the last I don't know. They all look pretty intimidatable to me. <laughs> she looks like, yo, we, we got one. Got one. Got one. Got one. <laughs> she is scared of clowns. Oh, oh. <laughs> she said, on me, you are horrified. As soon as he comes up to her, she gonna dookie her draws on Granny. I hope you got a diaper on. <laughs> Adult diaper season is in. Half off at Walmart. Yeah, dig. Like, oh, you're so cute. He needs more makeup. I mean, uh, no, she doesn't. And then come on up. Oh, oh you gotta hump the and the nose. Okay, you're both. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, you would you put no? Oh! Just be his friend. You can probably make a balloon. <laughs> touch the nose. Touch the fro. Touch the nose. <laughs> so when did you uh, realize you were afraid of clowns? It was around the age of seven. I watched the- Word of advice, never show fear around clowns. They'll eat that fear, bro. That's how they get stronger. They feed off the fear. Most clowns live underground in the sewers, okay? <laughs> you didn't see the movie It? Pennywise? I feel on your fear. Hi, Georgie. What a nice boat. <laughs> Actually forced me to watch the movie with her. Circuses, mm. haunted houses. Mm. What was your physical reaction to the clown being here? Well, I'm already like shaking. Think about it again. I'm sweaty. My heart's Bruh. beating so fast. Like I cannot. How bad is it affecting your life? Clowns aren't just walking around the world as yeah, often are. anymore. Oh yeah, they are. Trust me, there's a bunch of clowns out there. <laughs> I mean, you're not that scary. There we go. I think I just cured the first one. <laughs> first patient right here cured. I think it's the whole get up. Cotton balls? I've heard of people being grossed out by the sound of cotton rubbing, but I didn't realize there was a phobia. How are you going to test people? I'll throw it at every one of them one by one. Like, if I just, like... <laughs> See, like, they're not, you know, no one's... No one's... Is this even real? Oh! <laughs> How's it going? Been better. Been better. This is freaking you out. May I ask why? Cotton? I, if I touch it, like... What the frick? How are you scared of cotton? <laughs> what? You're scared of cotton? You realize that shirt you're they're wearing is probably made out of cotton, right? Yo, what the freak is going on, dog? This is like that. Some of yo, some stuff be hurting my damn head. <laughs> like my teeth hurt. Whoa. Yeah. I mean, like gone to the doctors about this or talk to anybody about this? <laughs> no. Do 
Lana that's something that you could house. fix in like five minutes just by like chilling at the house and being like, why the frick am I afraid of an inanimate object that creates warmth and comfort? <laughs> it's probably my pillows, my blankets, my damn like sofa, like all that crap. Like, come on now. That's a ridiculous fear. I find ways around it, so I don't really care at this point. So you're an individual that avoids obstacles instead of going through them. When it comes to cotton, yeah. It's just cotton balls. I mean, look at this thing. I'm just put on my hands a sweat a little bit. You know what I mean? Do they talk to you? <laughs> doesn't do anything. Doesn't attack you. Doesn't hurt you. Yeah, it does. It, just it takes does. It hurts me. It hurts my teeth. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> The whole goal today is to cure everybody of their phobia. You think phobias can be cured? I think phobias can be cured, absolutely. I know in ancient Sparta, whatever you were afraid of, they would like force you to be in a cage with it. <laughs> so if you're afraid of like a bear or some crap, <laughs> they would put you in a cage with a bear. If you were afraid of wolves, you'd have to go out into the wilderness to like <laughs> hunt a wolf and stuff like that, bro. It was like crazy in ancient Sparta. Oh, 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 someone jumped. Who was okay, that? Okay, oh, so got one. Got one. Look at that. See? Max. He's scared too. That's good. <laughs> How about we just have her hold it? No, we don't. <laughs> no, there it is. There it is. Oh, Go for it. That's a double hitter. I had an experience when I was seven years old. I was just petting it and it started to hump my arm. I don't like that. I don't like being humped by anything I just meet. But it didn't bite you. No, <laughs> really. I just meet. I would never let it get close enough to bite me. Oh, okay. You want to sit down and, and release the bunny? Sit. <laughs> release the bunny. There you go, buddy. <laughs> no. Look at how cute he is. Attack. Do you think you can hold the bunny? Just I sit will down. sit down and try. Bro, you missed out on the other bunny person. Oh my gosh. Why did she actually throw up? I couldn't tell. It's gross. Who was scared? Hi. What's up? I remember me and my friends used to pretend to throw up in the middle of like English class. We'd be like, Wah! <laughs> Oh God, we were scared of the shit out of everybody. <laughs> I remember one time I went up to one of my teachers. I was like, teacher, I don't feel good. She's like, please don't throw up on me. I'll send you to the office right now. <laughs> I mean, we used to troll in high school, not gonna lie. <laughs> No. Hi. Hi. Oh, ding, ding, ding. So are you afraid to look at it, smell it? Anything what is it? to do with the sound? Uh, mm -hmm. What? Do you have any like physical um, reactions to? Well, right now I'm shaking. Oh yeah, you are. <laughs> Just from that. Sometimes I'll start crying. I like hyperventilate. It's not doing anything. It's just chilling. All right. <laughs> <It's> there. <laughs> what do you think the mom's gonna do to you? It it just makes me feel gross. <laughs> Okay. Do you want to overcome this phobia? At some point. Well, there's no better time than now. And we've got a bucket of puke right here. Like, would you touch it? <laughs> no, no, no. You Drink the puke. Drink the puke. You don't even have to look. Mm -mm. Would you put your hand mm -mm. in the bucket but not touch anything? No. <laughs> Thank you, though. Yeah. Fear of ladders? I think someone's afraid of going up it. How far? Yeah, I think you're good. Right Bro, yeah, she's ladder. scared of like oh, everything it looks like. You're kind of scared. Are you scared? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. Everyone has to touch <laughs> a ventilation system. Don't look down. Look at the Look at that. Oh, See, so touch it. I'm 
Yeah. See now, being afraid of that? being afraid of heights is like the only valid fear I've seen so far, because like you could actually die if it's too high. <laughs> Can't die from a damn cotton ball unless you start shoving them down your damn throat, and nose, and crap. This phobia. I was like thirteen or fourteen on a family trip driving in Yosemite Park. I fell asleep on the window, and I guess we were like driving on the side of the cliff or whatever. Uh... And then like I woke up and I just like <laughs> see all the way straight down, and I started. Like, Falling. I can see how that's traumatic. Okay, everybody close your eyes. Lassie's das. <laughs> I got nuts. It seems like it's all washed, so I'm gonna have everyone just take a bite. Everyone, have some nuts. Um. Oh. <laughs> People are afraid of nuts. You got chew, chew, chew. All the nuts in your mouth. Ah. Hey, yo. All the nuts. No, you gotta bite. <laughs> you gotta bite. You can do it. I think it's you. Because you're the most reluctant to eat the apple. Your phobia. Yes. Oh, so these are all actual phobias that they have. They're not just guessing randomly. <laughs> oh, my head. My head. I can see if you're afraid of nuts if you have a peanut allergy. Because it's like, you know, death. <laughs> but just being afraid of damn nuts. They, bro, they're such a healthy food item. <laughs> Nuts. Nope. It's your teeth. Yeah. I'm afraid of them falling out. You're afraid of your teeth falling out because yes. they might get you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why are you afraid of your teeth falling out? My mom told me that her orthodontist tightened her braces way too tight, and so her front tooth like filled up with blood, and they had to remove it and all that. So that was just like a huge fear of mine. I don't think that's uh, hard. I think you can overcome that. I think that. it's pretty hard. I usually just crack it in half. Like How about crack in half your teeth? Mm -hmm. You're not drinking enough milk. I don't like milk. Start drinking milk. I will. <laughs> right. Thank you. Next. Milk is just not very good for you. You're literally, bro, milk is cow baby food. Humans are not supposed to be eating cow baby food. You're literally drinking the, the bodily secretions of a cow. And people have been tricked into thinking that crap is healthy. It's not. <laughs> you can literally just get some like calcium supplements or mag calcium and magnesium supplements. That's usually what I do. Calcium, magnesium supplements. Milk, no. That's cow food. You're not a cow. You're a human. Okay? <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Bro. Oh! <laughs> okay. I think we found my phobia. Oh, How many people are scared of spiders? Most of them are looking terrified on that. Wow. Bit. I don't have a fear of spiders, so. so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a fear of spiders either. It just gets freaky when they try to crawl up your clothes and crap. But I think that's like anything. If a squirrel tried to crawl up my pants leg, I'd be pretty freaked out too. Because I think it's going to try to bite my nutsack or my dingling or something. You know what I mean? Like if, if a rat or like a, or even like a roach crawled up my damn pants leg, I'd be freaked out because I think they're going to bite my mucus. You know what I mean? Then my mucus would be all like red and stuff, you know? <laughs> all right, man. I'll keep this way over here. So you won't even, you won't, you won't go no, close it. What care. if it was like on the outside? I don't care. No? What if I blocked it? I don't care. You know? <laughs> so what's up with spiders, man? All right, so little 10 year old me trying to get some fruit in the back in the garden. A whole bunch of spider fell on me. How many? Thousands of those. Thousands of Thousands these? Thousands of those fell on my valid. body. Valid. That's How a valid fear. I passed out. <laughs> Fail. When you run to what? You can't just be passing out when you're scared. That's like a death response. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If this was back in the days when we were like tribal, you would have not survived. You know what I mean? You wouldn't have survived if a, like, a leopard was chasing. You would have just passed out and they would have ate the whole person. You, they would have came in for the mega eat. You know what I'm saying? What if you're getting hunted by, by a pack of wolves like uh, 400, th what? Like 1,000, 2,000 years ago. Do you know what I mean? You would have gotten mega eaten by all that pack of wolves too. You know what I'm saying? It's it's fight or flight, not fight, flight, and freeze. If you freeze, you're dead. You know what I'm saying? Darwin is a natural selection. Survival of the fittest. Yeah, dig. In the spider webs when you're walking around, like how freaked out do you get? She all start passing out. Dang. God damn. Watch that. Huh? Watch that. Just sit down. <laughs> Put your hand on that flat. No matter what, don't freak out. All right. Just <laughs> go ahead. Yo, it's okay. He's just looking at the way he can't talk again. He's looking to see where he can walk. Okay, hold on. I'll connect. I'll connect. I'll connect. All right, we'll do it again. All right. He at least on. has mental fortitude. Here we go. That man is doing the nay nay over there. He said. That shit felt like the devil just touched me. You're proud of yourself, man. It was fun, but obviously.
obviously no one else at the time because it was their fear. Definitely found out I'm more afraid of spiders than I thought. I think I have all of the above. You guys can overcome this stuff. And if you don't have the right support network, I'll come hang out with you guys and do this all day. <laughs> Thanks, Bro, do you gotta take a dookie or something? What the frick going on, dog? I've been petting you this entire video and you over here. <laughs> like, relax, dog. You know what I'm saying? Hey, what's up with that? You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to record a video and this dude over here gonna make all types of noises, farting and stuff. You know what I'm saying? I, I would've covered my nose, but I would've made the video worse. Anywho, I hope y'all like this video. You know, phobia is a strange thing. The only stuff you should be afraid of is stuff that can literally directly kill you. Bears, okay, valid. Wolves, okay, valid. Hyenas, okay, valid. But you shouldn't freeze if you see those. You need to be able to run. You dig? Otherwise, you're just a, 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 a sitting duck, a, a target. Do you know what I mean? If you're afraid of cotton and inanimate objects and stuff like that, that's an L. Uh, yeah, I gotta take my dog out because this man wants to dookie on my carpet. So, <laughs> I'll catch you all later. I'm out!